Hey collective, we're gonna do a quick energy check, see what your ancestors, the universe, the divine want you guys to know as you're navigating through your journey, ascending to your highest good. I've already called in the appropriate protection. This is the time this reading. It's whenever it finds you. I hope you guys are having a beautiful Friday morning. The mach time machine. Number three, mind, body, and soul. Some of you guys. Okay, so what Spirit is saying here is that if this hasn't happened, get ready because this is about to happen. Spirit is about to take you down memory lane of your past life, time machine. Somebody's about to get, um, have a trip down memory lane, their past life. This is going to be something really powerful for you. You're going to unlock something there. Roots of abundance. Number five, number two. When, when I first started a couple of months ago maybe like seven eight may, maybe like nine months ago I was telling you guys that I had a dream and Spivet was showing me um, a past life of mine and it was old times it was like colonial like old times like one house per every fucking 10, 10, 10 miles. And in that lifetime, I was, I was white. Um, I had a husband. And Spivet showed me a life a, a happy moment of my life at that time. I was on a horse, riding a horse. I had like, the dirt was, the, the floor, the outside was like muddy, like rain, rain hit. And it was, we, I had a farm, a stable. My husband was there. His name was Adam. And if I'm not mistaken, I believe that he kept calling me Kate. And Spirit just showed me like a happy moment of that lifetime. Somebody's about to go through this. Somebody's about to go down memory lane. Spirit's about to show somebody their past life. Close encounters. Number 10. I just, I just heard in my head, you're gonna meet somebody. You're gonna see somebody from your past life that you know in this life. If you don't physically know them, physically, your soul is gonna recognize this person.
and I had a horse. My hair was red. And my husband was just watching me. Like having so much fun. I remember just the laughter, the laughter that came out of my voice. And I was just in bliss. And it's so crazy because in this lifetime now, I love horses. I want to own a horse. That made sense to me. It clicked in my head what spirit was showing me. That dream was a past life, and that's why I'm so factuated with horses. Shower of blessings. Show us the cards we need to see, please, and thank you, ancestors of the highest white light. Ascension flames merge with light, ignite keys and codes. Look it. Keys. Something's about to be unlocked. Ignite keys with codes. Things are going to start to make sense to you. I am present. I am present. Expand your stellar gateway. I am that I am. And in and, and that, I remember. It was more to that dream than just that, but that's the part I remember the most. Was watching my husband come down the house, the steps, and me riding on the horse. heal your soul this is gonna help you're gonna get some kind of some kind of message through this time machine this powerful move something is gonna be shown to you in your past life that's gonna help you make a powerful move to your abundance you're also for some of you guys your your soul is gonna recognize somebody from the past that's in your life right now you're gonna identify who your soulmate is Soul healing, align with your essence, see your true colors. I feel like a lot of you guys have done so much healing that this is why Spirit is bringing this in for you. You're, you're now open to receive more information. You're aligning yourself with your divine essence. You're expanding your mind, your conscience. You're ready to do this time machine. Yeah. Somebody's about to go down memory lane. Some of you guys, you're from your star seeds, from Lyria. I was about to take you down a magic carpet ride. What did I just say? Your star seeds? Did I not just say that? Show us the card we need to see. Yes, Spirit said, yes, somebody's about to go through this. Somebody's about to go through a time machine. Just say yes, Spirit said. Just say yes. High Priestess. 
High Priestess. Some of you guys are High Priestess. How are you being called to step up and lead? For some of you guys, Spirit is going to show you how to do this. Because you're going to be the one to start helping other people go through the time machine. You have a natural ability to do that in your past life. Because you guys don't dim your light to fit in with this crowd, with the crowd or the 3D people. How are you dimming your light in order to fit in? Some of you guys may be doing this. And Spivit is about to show you who the fuck you are. Who you were in a past life. Don't dim your light. You are. I am presence. You are. Somebody was in charge of doing this in their past life, Stargate, helping bring people from this life and showing them their past life. Somebody did that in their past life. You were the gatekeeper, I heard. Oh, my ears just went sonic. Yeah, look at this. Sisterhood of the Rose, beauty and devotion, priestess, mystic, teacher. I know what I'm feeling. I'm seeing it. In your past life, you was the person to say, yes, you could come through this gate. You can see your past life. That's how I'm seeing it. Like you help guide people to see their past lives. Some of you guys may feel may be feeling like this is a burden. Like it's too much for you. You're gonna have victory and success. You're gonna have victory and success at this. Whatever this is, Spirit is about to show you, it's gonna bring you towards your, your abundance. This time machine, it's gonna bring you to your abundance. It's like you dictated who could go through the portal and who couldn't go through the portal. That's how I'm beating this card right now. Spivet has me beating my deck differently right now. You're going to be able to identify when somebody's ready to pass through and see their past life and when they're not. What 
most ancestors. Yeah, you're gonna be able to identify when somebody's coming from a true heart space, their authenticness, selflessness, loving, caring, authentic, to pass through that portal and see their past life. I'm not making this up. You're going to be showing people their past lives. You got to be strong because somebody's about to go through this. It may feel like a burden. Spirit said you were made for this. You were made for this. You're going to be helping guide people. Many past lives. How many past lives they've had. Showing them what they've done. Be strong. Some of you guys may be feeling like this is a burden. Like it's gonna be too much for you. You're gonna be the one to unlock the gate. And you're gonna be guided by Spivet. Spivet is gonna guide you the whole way. It's like you're gonna take, you're gonna be the one to take these people on the time machine now. Whoa. Yeah, Spivet is about to prep somebody. The gateway is open and the pathway is clear. My journey begins. I can never make this up, collective. Seek balance and grounding. Yeah, you're gonna be need. You're gonna need to stay balanced and grounded. Spirit said, as you're doing this, because this is gonna take a lot of energy from you. I know myself deeply and find myself worth. You're you're definitely gonna do that. You're gonna know exactly who you were in your past life. There's not gonna be any confusions here. Wow. You're going to help guide people. You're going to help other people see what they've done in past lives. Help them understand what's going on in this life so they don't make these same mistakes. You're going to help guide people towards their victory, guiding them out of confusion through the portal to victory. So I said, you are strong for this. This is beautiful. You're gonna be protected too. You're gonna be guided by Spivet. It's gonna help other people heal, heal their souls. It's gonna help people get through that Stargate. It's gonna help people go through their ascension. It's going to help people want to walk their path. It's going to guide people to say yes. Yeah. 
You're gonna know who to say no to. You can't come through this portal. Banishment. find this here. Something about autumn. I keep seeing this card. Autumn is coming up. You're being picked for this because you're responsible. You're responsible. Something with this autumn car, Spirit just got me gazing on it. It's like, you see how big this tower is? You see that little light in that window? You're gonna be the light for other people. There's three high priestess cars out here already. Three of them. blessings because this is about to happen for somebody somebody's about to see what they did in many lifetimes they were a gatekeeper to help other people remember and see their past lives it's like you're going to be taking people through a time machine unlocking keys unlocking codes putting pieces on the puzzle that they can't get seem to get Whatever this is, it's going to help people make powerful moves to their abundance. This is beautiful. I love you, Archangel Michael. You can to me. You're highly protected. You're being guided, not only by your ancestors. You have Archangel Michael here protecting you. They're going to be guiding you, giving you the strength, walking you through this. You're going to know which people to let through that portal and which people to banish from this portal, not seeing coming through. You're going to know. It's like these people are going to come bare to you. And Arch Archangel Michael, transformation at the bottom of the deck. Archangel Michael is going to be guiding you. Whoever this, whoever I'm speaking for, this person is highly intuitive. This person is a high priestess. My ears just went under sonar again. 
High Priestess came out three times in this reading. Unconditional love, you gave me love. You're gonna know what I just got from this. No matter what these people's past lives are, what they're experiencing in this lifetime, as you're walking them through this, you're gonna keep them. Your your heart is so pure. You're gonna. Oh my God! Don't make me cry, spirit. No matter what it is that they've done, you're gonna, your presence there is gonna let them know that they are still unconditionally loved. I don't know why spirit is about to make me cry. Stop doing that, spirit, please. You're the perfect person for this. You're strong. You're 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 high, you're highly intuitive. You're a high priestess. You're able to identify negative energies that are not good to go through this portal. You're going to read people. But you're also very loving and uncondition unconditional loving towards people. You're not going to judge them when they come through. Oh, shit. You're going to bring the light to these people. Oh, my God. Into me. You're going to know exactly what to do. You're going to be guided. You're going to follow synchronicities. Follow the synchronicities, guys. Thank you, angels. I trust your well-timed guidance and signs. Spirit's going to guide you. You're worthy of this transformation again. Somebody's about to see me what they used to do in their past life and then this person is going to be the one to help other people go through this time machine this is what you did in your past life spirit is about to show you it you're about to unlock the key put that peace some of you guys may be sitting here thinking like i know for me when i connect with somebody so deeply Spirit is like, Spirit lets me see through their eyes of who they were through their past life. And like I told you guys, ever since my awakening, my, my abilities have been so crazy. Like I was able to start seeing how, who people were in their past lives. I don't know how else to explain that to you. And it's sad. It gets sad when you start seeing how people are bound, bound, um, bound to like old past life issues, and they and they and they're still sleeping in the 3D. And here in this life, they're walking around unaware. It's sad. It makes it. it sometimes it makes your heart heavy for these people. But spirit said you are responsible. Your unconditional love. Is gonna help guide these people, and you're only you're backed by Archangel Michael and your ancestors. You're strong for this. You were made for this. You could do this. This is what I have for you, collective love and light.